entrance was by ticket only, and among the fighters on the bill were eight-year-old boys. Imagine what yeah. these guys are going to be like in 15 years' time. And, uh, you've got, look at that, flagging for the single. Ray Single gets the side control. After seeing the footage, one person alerted the police, but the event breached no licensing regulations and is within the law. But the boys were not wearing protective headgear or pads, and at one point, one of the schoolboy fighters is seen to break down in tears. I mean, this is the one danger that you've got with juniors, is that, you know, they can be yeah. gallant and game to get in the cage. Despite widespread condemnation, one father told us he was completely happy for his nine-year-old son, Kian to take part. He does it himself. Nobody forces him to do it. He gets asked, does he want to do it? And he says, yeah, I'll do it. So nobody forces him. And we can't stop him. If he wants to do it, he enjoys doing something, then let him go ahead and do it. You know when you get into the cage, what, what's your feeling when you're going into the cage? What, just describe that for us. Excited. And what do you like about it? It's fun. The British Medical Association described the event in Preston as particularly disturbing as the children were not wearing headgear. The NSPCC joined in the criticism, saying that at the age of eight, children's bodies were still developing physically and mentally. The British Cage Fighting Association said it was totally against the participation of children. It said, this is disgusting, and any parent that allows their child to cage fight must be a moron. But one of the trainers in Preston says people have misunderstood. It's people are like homing in on the fact that it's cage this, cage that. It's a mixed martial arts demonstration. They did two three-minute rounds with no winner. They both got a trophy at the end. There was a professional referee. We've got like professional medical staff. It was, you know, every, every precaution was taken. Well, this is the spot where the cage fighting took place before an audience of about 200 people. But despite the criticism that they faced here at the Greenland's new Labour Club today, they say that they fully intend to stage another similar event in a few months' time. So, you know, Luke is a very skilled fighter. He moves very well. Lancashire police have investigated the event but have taken no further action as the activity is completely legal. Mike McCarthy, Sky News. Preston.